Hey guys, today I have another thrift haul for you. Um, but today it's kind of different, I think, yeah. Uh, we have a theme, so I've been really into the um, grunge style lately. Uh, you can kind of tell with my last video. Um, yeah, so I went to the thrift store with that style in mind and I found a few good pieces um hopefully I will wear them a lot so yeah this is the this is the the haul so um we're gonna get into it but first I think I'm gonna do just a couple of like little updates kind of because I want to and I haven't posted in two weeks I think so I think it's warranted um first I just want to show you guys how cute my nails are right now I did them myself it's got a little bow and then rhinestones and then this is my other hand super cute next I wanted I wanted to let y'all know even though no one asked but I got my permit and I'm super proud of myself. Um, so now, catch me on the road. Catch me driving on the road. It's gonna be awesome. Yeah, and that's that's it. Um, we can get into the haul now. All right. Um, I'm just gonna go in order of like which thing is first on top of the the pile. So first, I have this necklace. It's very similar to, um, to, um, like, the necklaces that have been trending this spring. Um, yeah. It does have some, like, wear on it, but I kind of like that. Um, yeah, just, it's, it's a really cute necklace. I really like it. Um, yeah. So, that is the first item of this haul. Next, I got a bag, which is really cool. Um, I have like, if I'm gonna buy a bag, it needs to fit my like qualifications for a bag. So it's gotta be fabric because if I'm buying a second hand bag, I like to be able to wash it because um, if like, I understand if you buy like a leather bag or some type of like uh other material then you can like disinfect it like wipe it down but it always feels grimy to me and i hate that so i like to buy fabric bags so i can put them in the wash and then they don't feel grimy um so and then also it's got to be big because i have a lot of stuff that i like to carry in my bag and it's got to be crossbody because i like functionality um, and this fits all of my uh, requirements for a bag, and it's like the style that I've been into. So it's this is what it looks like. It's very worn and distressed, which I like. Um, yeah, I don't know. I saw it, and I was like, yeah, that's really cute. So I got it. Um, the brand, if you are interested, I believe it's Sonoma. Yes, Sonoma Lifestyle. There you go. Um, so, yeah, that's the next thing. I've yet to wear this because I just washed it. I just washed um, pretty much all this stuff, so I haven't really worn any of it yet. If you would like to see um, possibly like how I style these pieces, um, follow me on Instagram. The link will be in the description. And if you like any of these pieces, most likely they will be on my Depop soon because I can tell very quickly if I'm going to wear an item a lot. Um, and if I decide I'm not going to wear it a lot, I will just list it on my, Depop, on my Depop. So that will also be in the description if you want to buy any of these. Um, next is this top, which I actually really like. Um, it's kind of questionable, I think, but it's, I really, I really enjoy this top. So it's just like a really flowy 
tie-dye top but it's by the brand Cabby and that's really it's a good brand and it's 100% silk um, basically if you know me if something is 100% silk like like I was looking at this top and I was like yeah this is like what I'm going for I think and I was feeling it I was like could be silk could be polyester I saw it was silk I was like yeah like I'm getting this I don't know why but yeah I yeah I really like this it just looks really nice to me and it's quality and that's what I'm going for not only um grunge but like quality um pieces I guess I don't know but also also uh, most of these pieces aren't very quality but um next this is kind of um not really like that that I kind of just needed more workout clothes so I picked this up but I wanted to show it because it's really cute um it's this puma navy blue workout top um the thing that sold me on it is it's double zip which I really like this zipper though was being really annoying and I accidentally broke it but it should be fine hopefully um yeah it's really flattering and it was half off at the thrift store so I was like yeah yeah um yeah I really like this it's so cute um I've been looking for more cute workout clothes okay next is this t-shirt it's a like worn in I just like the skull on it t-shirt I actually wore this the other day um yeah I don't know it's just a t-shirt but yeah I think it's cute okay next we actually have a couple pairs of jeans which is interesting the first pair um are these I like the um distressing on them and they're worn in which I like that I believe these are by express that's what my dad told me x2 denim laboratory what the freak is that supposed to mean but he told me they're by express but yeah they're a nice fit and like I said I like the distressing and wear and let me show you the back right they're just really cute and i i love the wash as well um me personally if jeans are too light wash or too dark wash i'm not gonna wear them so i like to get medium wash and these are kind of like I don't know, they're cool wash i really like these i got those and then i got these these are more like early 2000s and honestly, I don't know how much I'm gonna wear these ones because they're more tight fitting and uncomfortable. And I don't wear uncomfortable things, so we'll see. But they're, they're really cute. And they're very flattering, I think. Um, yeah, and then this is the back of them. Yay, so cute. Yeah. Um, but I got those. Basically, anything that actually fits me, I'm like, I don't know. Like, I usually like to go, like, a size up because I just, I hate being uncomfortable. I hate it. Okay, next. I love this. I love this. It's so cute. It's so cute. Um, it's this little, like, shawl kind of thing. The cut it's so cool i love how it's cut it's like so flattering and cool it's asymmetrical if you look at the button it buttons there and then underneath of it it actually has like extra fabric there so it's really interesting like this just caught my eye and it's made in italy by delia uh <laughs> I'm not gonna I'm not gonna 
Anyways, that's the brand. Yes, I really like this. So, that's that. Okay, this is the last item. It's kind of underwhelming, but I still think it's cute. Um, it's this, like, tank top. And, once again, worn and distressed. Um, yeah, I don't know. It's just, it's really cute. What does it say? I don't know. Um, I, yeah, I don't know. It was just very appealing to me. It's got even, like, some holes in it and stuff. I don't know. That's just what I'm into right now, you know. Um, but yes, this is also kind of like, it is cropped. Like it is a cropped shirt and I'm not like the most comfortable in those. So we'll see how long this stays in my closet. It might be up on my Depop very soon, who knows. Um, but yeah, that is it for this haul. I really hope you guys enjoyed um thank you for watching um like i said i have other social medias that will be linked in the description and i post on this channel fashion related content mostly so if you're into that uh and like my style even though my style does change quite a bit um but if you're into like fashion and stuff then you should probably subscribe to my channel and I think that's it. Once again, thank you for watching. Um, I hope you have a good, a good day. Bye.